Hi, and welcome to the third part of the guide on how to create spatial videos for Apple Vision Pro using Mystica Boutique. In this tutorial, we will focus on composing objects in a spatial video. We start with a 3D clip already adjusted as explained in the first and second parts of this guide. Now, to integrate a 2D graphic into this 3D image, we must add depth to the graphic. To achieve this, select the graphic and add a stereo 3D effect. Given that this graphic or object is 2D, there's no need to correct the geometry, our goal is to provide depth. Navigate to balance geometry, and using the position X parameter, manage the disparity to control the depth at which the object is displayed. The challenge here is to blend the background with the graphic and, based on the depth of the original clip, position the object at a suitable depth level. First, select the entire stack, go to FX, and apply a Comp 3D. This node will merge the title and the clip. If you want to control the position of the graphic in X and Y, or the scale, it is always recommended to add a new layer in your Comp 3D. At the moment, we have two layers, the background and the text, and in Comp 3D, there's only one. This way, we can move the object and place it where we want. Now let's manage the depth of the graphic. To do this, we can use a very useful tool called the Depth Graph. Once opened, make sure it's in Depth Radar mode. This scope allows you to visualize the depth level of the shot, making it helpful to identify if the shot has elements closer to the viewer, represented by the blue line, or if they appear inside the virtual screen on the Apple Vision Pro, represented by the red line. The green line represents the virtual screen itself. Now, let's use this scope to know how much we move the text towards the viewer. Double-click on the Comp 3D to visualize the composition, and with a single click, select the Stereo 3D effect of the graphic to control its depth. Adjust with Position X to refresh the view of the depth graph, and as you can see, we can evaluate to what depth level we are moving it. This technique can be applied to any type of object, even 3D, that already has stereoscopy applied. In fact, Mystica allows animating the Position X parameter to create depth animations. Activate Auto Key. Set the value you want at the current frame. Move on the timeline. And set another value. Animating the depth of a 3D clip can be beneficial for both creative tasks and technical adjustments. This is especially useful if an object protrudes too much from the virtual screen to the point of being uncomfortable. This composition example is just a glimpse of what you can do in Mystica Boutique to generate content for Apple Vision Pro. To the composition, you could add color correction, sharpening, denoising, and more. Mystica will automatically adapt these effects to work in spatial mode. If you want more tutorials on other aspects of Mystica Boutique covering spatial content for Apple Vision Pro, let us know in the comments. We'll be happy to expand this guide with more features and surprises based on your feedback. We hope you found this tutorial helpful. Subscribe to our YouTube channel or follow us on social media to stay up to date on the latest news and updates from Mystica Technology. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.